The new push to expand Kansas City Streetcar, it's only been running for a little more than a month, and some people already want the line to expand. 41 Action News reporter Sarah Plake is live at a new possible stop for the streetcar. Sarah. Good morning. Right here at 51st and Brookside is where that extended route would end, rolling right up to UMKC's doorstep. Now, after the streetcar's initial success, advocates pushing for this say that the extended route would better connect people to downtown and beyond. So the Kansas City Regional Trans Transit Alliance submitted a petition to Jackson County Courts to approve a $227 million proposal for that expansion. It would take the streetcar route from River Market to about 53rd Street at UMKC. This would be funded by the people who work and live along the route through sales tax and property tax. We asked some streetcar riders what they think. We own property off of Main Street, a condo, my wife and I. Uh, I'm hoping they do it. It's going to make the property value go up. Um, it's easy to get around. Um, I think it's a fantastic idea. Happy to support it. If it goes to UMKC, is it going to be free all the way out? And that's, that's an enormous question because free streetcar out to UMKC really starts to cut into fair revenue for the Area Transportation Authority. Now to answer that question, would it still be free? KCRTA tells me that there is money in the plan to keep it free. However, people that are within the transit district will ultimately vote on that and they would have the final say, yes or no, to go forward with the expansion project. If it does go through, it wouldn't be finished by 2022. In Kansas City, Sarah Plake, 41 Action News.